Hello everybody, welcome to the channel. Today let's take a look at FSR 3.0 Frame Generation Mod by Luke FC. And we're playing Power World on Steam Deck Steam OS. So I showed you how to install this mod for Power World on Steam Deck Steam OS yesterday. I have a video up. If you don't know how to do that, please follow that. I'll leave a link in the description. This is just a follow-up video because yesterday when I installed the mod, we did have some issues. We had the UI flickering and we had ghosting on the character. All right, so we're going to fix that today. So this is the game without the mod. So let's say we're in this area. We get 30-ish frames without the mod. If we look into the sky where nothing is happening, you get 40-ish, 50. All right. So, yeah. Now, let's turn on the mod. Okay, I've got to quit the game. I'm going to turn on the mod. I've already done that, um, you know, the mod files. So, I'm just going to add the launch options to enable the mod. Okay. Okay. So, yeah, in this video, the main goal is to follow up yesterday's installation video and fix the UI flickering and the ghosting. I didn't figured this out someone in discord called logarithm i think that's how you pronounce his name shout out to you thank you for letting me know this method okay now start the game so we should be in the same area so if you remember we get like 30 ish frames so now with the mod on Okay, you can see the UI is flickering. And the character, you see the ghosting. Yeah. So the mod is definitely on. So we get 40-ish frames here. 40-ish, 50. If we look in the sky, I think we get like 60-ish. Yeah, if we look in the sky, you get 60 frames. Um, yeah, on the open field, we get 40-ish. So the mod is definitely working. But we need to fix this UI flickering. Okay, so in order to do that, go to Options, and then Graphics. Okay, you can see here, Anti-Aliasing, it's grayed out. It's because we've got DLSS enabled here. Okay, so first thing you need to do, turn DLSS off, and then go to Anti-Aliasing. We can just set it to TAA. You can set it to whatever you want, except for TSR. Okay, but I'm just going to set it to TAA. And then go back to DLSS and toggle to whatever preference you want. I'm going to set it to quality and then back out of it. Make sure you apply change settings. Yes. Yeah, you can see that the UI is not flickering anymore and we don't have ghosting on the character and we still have like 40 ish frames. So if we look in the sky. You get like 60 frames. Yeah, so it does work. It does work. I kind of feel like um like if you turn the anti-aliasing from TSR to like something else, it does like impact the frame rate. It's not as high as TSR, but we did fix the UI flickering and ghosting. So I think that's a little trade-off. And we still get better performance than like no mod at all. So I think this is worthwhile. I haven't like played a lot of this game. So, uh, you know, maybe you should try it and, you know, play deeper into the game and let me know in the comments if this really helped out. Because, yeah, I'm not really spending a lot of time playing this game. So that's not my purpose. I'm not going to test out every single location. I'm just going to show you what could be done and what can be done. So if you like this game and you want to play it better on the Steam Deck with better performance, try this out. All right, I hope this video helped you out. It's just a quick one for an update. All right, let me know in the comments if you want to see other FSR 3 mods on different games. All right, so I hope this video helped you out. If it did, please leave a like and subscribe to the channel if you haven't already. All right, and I'll see you guys in the next one. Later.